What's up guys, welcome to another tutorial on my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use the AI translation to translate your voice into different language using Filmora 13. Okay, so I think this is a very interesting feature because with just your original voice, you can convert your voice into Korean, Japanese, German, English, Hindi, Arabic, or stuff like that. It is very interesting. Okay, so let me show you how to do that. For example, now I have an intro of me talking in English, and now we have different version. Let's start it. 왜 그래? 내 채널에 또 다른 자습서에 오신 것을 환영합니다. 어, 이 비디오에서 어떻게 인공지능 번역을 사용하는지 보여드리겠습니다. ¿Qué pasó? Bienvenido a otro tutorial en mi canal. En este video le mostraré cómo usar la traducción de inteligencia artificial para traducir su voz a diferentes idiomas usando Fumora 13. O que se passa, meu? Bem-vindo a outro tutorial no meu canal. Neste vídeo mostrarei como usar a tradução de inteligência artificial para traduzir sua voz para um idioma diferente usando o Fumora 13. Okay, so that's interesting, right? By the way, if you want to use this feature, you should have the latest version of the software. And currently, I'm using Filmora 13.2.1. And if you want to upgrade to this latest version, you have to reinstall the software or just check for update inside the software, okay? And for those of you who want to purchase the software, don't forget to use my 30% discount coupon code in the description, okay? All right, so this is my example timeline. For example, I have a video here. This is uh, me talking and it is in English. And now if I want to have AI translation, all I need to do is to select the video here or the timeline. And then I would select this button. This is the AI translation. So this is the first solution to open the AI translation. Otherwise you can use the speak to text or text to speech option. This is the speak to text option and it will have the AI translation also. Okay. For example, I can click here, AI translation. And now the first thing you want to select the translation type here. Normally it will be your voice. If you want to translate your voice into a different language, you want to click here and translate voice and text. But sometimes you only have text. For example, all the timeline, you only have English subtitle and you want to translate it into Japanese, Korean subtitle. You can select here, only translate text. Okay. For now, I can select translate voice to text. And the next thing, you want to select the source language and the target language. For example, here we have the source language. So it is English, US. By the way, if you speak Spanish, French, Italian, or any other language here, you can convert it or translate it to other language too. Okay. So for me, I will select the source language is English. And the target language, for example, I can select Portuguese because I already have a Korean and Japanese demo. So now I will select Portuguese. Okay. And now we need to click here, translate to translate my voice into Portuguese. And remember this will, this will cost some AI credit here. Normally it will cost 16 AI credit. If you run out of AI credit, you have to purchase more from Watershare. For example, if you want to have more, you, you can just click this plus button. Okay. And you see the price. Uh, let me show you the price of the AI credit. So this is 1000 credit pack and it is $10 and it is $15 and it is $20 for 10,000 AI credit. Okay. So if you want to purchase more, just click the plus button to buy more and come back to the tutorial. Okay. Okay. And now we can click here to translate my voiceover into Portuguese. Okay. And we need to wait a few seconds and normally it will come to 90% and then it will stop there for a while. I have no idea. Okay. So maybe hopefully in the future, they will improve the speed of the translation. Okay. And now it is complete and you can close this window and on the timeline, there will be a subtitle here and your video is mute. And we have a translation voiceover here in Portuguese. So let's listen to it. Here, here is my Portuguese. O que se passa, meu? Bem-vindo a outro tutorial no meu canal. 
Neste vídeo mostrarei como usar a tradução de inteligência artificial para traduzir sua voz para um idioma diferente usando o Fumora 13. Está bem? Então eu acho que esse é um recurso muito interessante, porque contanto que sua voz original, você pode converter sua voz em coreano, japonês, alemão, inglês, hindi, árabe ou similar. Isso é muito interessante. Ok, deixa eu te dizer como fazer isso. Por exemplo, agora tem uma introdução ao meu discurso em inglês e agora temos versões diferentes. Vamos começar. So that's nice, right? And it looks like similar to my voice, but in Portuguese. Because I can also hear my accents in the Portuguese also. That's simple, right? So that is how to use the AI translation. And if you want to translate only the subtitle, it is also possible. For example, here I have a Portuguese subtitle. So I can select it and then I can select the AI translation again. So now it will select only translate text and we need to select the source language. And it is in Portuguese. Okay, so here's Portuguese. And we select Portuguese and then we want to translate back to English. So I will select the target language English. And now here we see the number of AI credit cost for this action. It is six AI credit. Okay, and now I'm going to click translate. And now the translation is faster in comparison with the voice translation. Okay, so let's click OK. And now we have the this is the English and this is Portuguese. So we have two versions and let's double click at the subtitle here. So I format it and make it another color so you can see it better. Okay, so I can make it in yellow and I can move it up here and then I can apply to all and select save. And now let's listen to it. English and Portuguese at the same time. Okay. O que se passa, meu? Bem-vindo a outro tutorial no meu canal. Neste vídeo mostrarei como usar a tradução de inteligência artificial para traduzir sua voz para um idioma diferente usando o Fumora 13. Está bem? Então eu acho que esse é um recurso muito interessante, porque contanto que sua voz original... Very nice, right? By the way, is anyone here from Portugal or Korea or Japan? Let me know if the the subtitle is correct or not, or the voice is correct or not. Okay, so I really want to, to know that because it is not my native language. All right, so that is how to use the AI translation feature in Filmora 13. I hope this video is helpful for you. If you have any question, just let me know in the comment section below. And if you like the video, just hit the like button. And if you are new here, consider to subscribe to my YouTube channel for more video like this. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Goodbye.